It is currently June 8th and it's about, it's 11 o'clock at night. Um, and it is the night before the Billie Eilish concert. <laughs> My parents has um my one of my graduation presents. They got me and my friend tickets to go to the Billie Eilish concert in Chicago since she's my favorite. Um, and in preparation, of course, I've been listening to music all day. But I am also going to be coloring my hair pink. So. I thought I had to have my hair wet. I actually just ran out to Walmart to go get this because originally I was going to be doing a hot pink and I was like, you know what, this lasts actually two to five shampoos, not, oh wait, this one's two to five shampoos, the other one was um, five to ten so I was getting worried because I don't really want my hair to be that hot pink for that long. So this one lasts a little shorter amount of time, which is good, that is what we want. Um, but yeah, so I went to Walmart and I got this one because I didn't have this in stock at Target earlier today. Um, and we're gonna do this. And I'm kind of nervous. <laughs> but yeah, so I got this one and I got another one because my hair is like not like long. It's like to here-ish now, but it's really, really thick. Like whenever I go to the hairdresser, she's like, it takes so long for her to do it because it's so thick. So, um, I'm gonna get started on this. It looks pretty easy. I'm just gonna get a towel to go around my neck because, like, yeah, this is pink, so it won't show up, but, like, I also don't want to destroy this sweatshirt because I wear it all the time. It's really comfy. Um, but, yeah, so... We'll see how this goes. <laughs> okay. I just did that. I just did that. My hair is gonna be pink. Oh my gosh. Okay, there's no going back now. through but I finished it and I may or may not have just done a thing. My hair is now going to be pink. I'm kind of excited but nervous. I don't know how this is going to turn out. I really wanted the like light rose gold kind of look ish so I don't know. We'll see how this goes. They didn't I wanted like the really light pink one. They didn't have it in stock like they said they did online. They said they had like five left. They had zero. But um, yeah. I mean, it's only two to five washes. So it will come out. If I really want to, I can literally wash it all out in one night if I want to. But I'm excited. I think it's so fun for the Billie Eilish concert. And, but yeah, so it's, uh, it's currently, let's see what time it is. It's 11.30. So at midnight, I'm going to wash this out. <laughs> We're gonna see how this goes. You ready for it? I'm pink. Oh my gosh. This is so weird. Oh my gosh. I like it. I'm definitely never getting this color permanently done in my hair. Um, it's a little too pink for me. Um, I think it will fade a little bit for sure, but, um, it's fun. It's really fun. I did not really style it at all. I just blow dried it because I wanted to see what it was going to look like. And I didn't really want dye at, like, all over my pillows or anything crazy like that. But, you know, um, I'm pink. I am very, very pink. This is a lot to take in. Oh, I don't know if I like it. I don't like 
it will fade and I think I will try not looking for it I think I'm a little nervous I think it's just because I don't have any makeup on it's not styled the way I would want it to be and I'm not wearing my outfit or anything but like it's fun it's very different I hope it doesn't stay tinted in my hair but I like it but I definitely don't want this in my hair forever but I'm glad I did this one because this one's two to five washes and the other one was like five to ten and I was like no not about top life but guys I'm pink I have pink hair <laughs> Starring My best friend, Dad. Uh, so yeah, obviously they were very good. How did you like yours? Good. Yeah, mine was delicious. A little too much honey mustard, but it was good. So it is the day of the concert, um, and this is what my hair ended up turning out to look like. It's very bright. I like it. Yeah, I like it, but. It's so different. I'm still not even used to it. And I probably won't get used to it because it only lasts like a few days. But look like Barbie. <laughs> like a Bratz doll. But yeah. The Barbie doll. Just a little bit. But um, we made a pit stop in West Lafayette for my dad for his job. And then we're on the way to Chicago. Chi-town. We made it to Chicago. Navy Pier, and I haven't been here since I was so little, and you've never been here before. Um, so, um, yeah, I haven't been here. But it's right by the water, and like literally, you can't see it's anything. So it sinks, we were gonna go on the Ferris wheel, but so it's foggy, it doesn't even look. Is it going? Yeah, it was. Oh. It was sure. My dad just bought us tickets for the swing. Ages 3 to 11. <laughs> Sounds good to me. Cheaper. I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm so excited. You can't even see, you the, can't see the view. It stinks. We were going to the wheel, which is not even worth it. It would be 50 city. bucks. There's the city. Right. Oh, look how pretty the city is. because this is not what I'm wearing and this is not what I'm going to look like for Billie Eilish. I hope not. Yeah, and I need to... Oh, I thank you very much. I hope not either. Oh, here's a Starbucks, but they don't have... I need a freaking outlet. And we need to charge our phones too because we're at like 16 and 20%. It's not good, so... Wish us luck. So we ended up getting ready in a Target bathroom and in the car. thought we were ready to go, going to the Argonne Ballroom. You know, venue change to United Center State, whatever, what is it called? 
Yeah, United Center. That means we're probably going to be um, nosebleed, but you know, I it looks like I have seats reserved because um, I bought my ticket so early in advance. So fingers crossed that's like the seats reserved for the United Center. Not sure. We'll see when we get there. I'm being a little nervous, but you know, we're gonna have fun. We're going to jam out to Billie Eilish, and it's going to be a fun night. <laughs> this is gonna be a day to remember. We got our tickets and we're not no please. We made it. I look where we're sitting. Not too bad. I mean I wish I could be there. We can sit down there later. <laughs> can we really? No. <laughs> no. Because there's so much security probably. But yeah. I even got my merch already. Can you hold, hold, me, hold it? We managed to cut the entire line. Not like, really sure how, but we know. did. <laughs> it's so cute. And it was the last one. It's a large, but you know, it'll shrink. So. All good? I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I'm so ready. It's kind of nice having a seat. Because then like, I feel safe about having my right. camera. There's more security too. <laughs> yeah. But I'm so excited. Oh, but it's not gonna be like the pit where you're all jumping up and down. I know. I wish that. Cause that's what I was looking forward to. Cause like Oregon yeah. Ballroom, like you get to jump up and down. It's like the Egyptian room. Exactly. Or like just a smaller venue in general. Cause I've seen on like her stories and everything when she posts about like um like the concerts and stuff. Yeah. It's like pit and like smaller yeah, venues. Yeah, that's what it's supposed to be. But I mean, it's all right. It's, it's Chicago. It makes sense. And we're gonna have fun. It makes sense for the Chicago. So like yeah. everyone comes from like Indiana, Michigan, probably Ohio. Not I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, but I mean, go girl for selling this kind of arena. Like, what the heck? She's 17. So, <laughs> I'm 17. <laughs> Well, very untalented right now. <laughs> it's weird. I'm 18, 17, and she has this big of a venue. Yeah, it's huge. But you know, I'm so excited. I'm pumped. I'm ready. So, can you think her brother? Okay. Interesting. But. Thank you.